Our Coastline Student Spring Retreat is our largest annual event of the year, and this was our fifth spring retreat to Camp Victory, and only the second where we were able to have all three Coastline Student Ministries involved. With our largest attendance of students and leaders ever, we knew this was gonna be a camp like no other. With this new year, it brought a few new changes to how we do camp, starting with asking our leaders to come up a day before our students. We recognize that leaders have lives and families, distractions and responsibilities that are all vying for their time and attention. And we know how difficult it can be to shift from these responsibilities to caring for the physical, mental, and spiritual health of a group of students. Students arrived on Monday and we jumped right in. We began with team flags and then a three-way relay where teams had to work together to complete a balance board challenge. And this was just the beginning of a week full of competition and team building, but ultimately ended in the red team taking home the trophy. Throughout the week, students competed in things like archery and rifles, climbing wall, kickball, and so much more. But this year, we wanted to do something a little extra special for our high school students. We were able to surprise our high schoolers with a hike to the back 40 acres of the camp where they competed in a game of Color War Capture the Flag. When it was all over, the camp staff came out and they prepared a special lunch just for them. We were so blessed to have guest speaker TJ Gillum from Mission of Hope join us this year as our guest speaker. TJ led our camp in morning devotions and evening chapel services. There really are no words that can accurately describe just the incredible move of the spirit that we all experienced at camp. From the student-led worship to the hard-hitting messages, this was just an unforgettable time with the Lord. I want to take a moment to thank all of our leaders for giving their time to serve the students this year, but I especially want to thank all of you who financially and prayerfully supported our student ministries and made it possible for so many students to attend this year. Thank you all for making this the greatest spring retreat ever. God has truly changed lives through this camp, but the work in these students' lives is far from over. Please continue to pray for all of the students and leaders that God would just continue to work and grow in their hearts and lives.